Well, one day he just showed up to practice, and then I didn't, I wasn't a big fan of him at first, but then everybody told me how big of a, big of a star he was and how big he is in the city. So I just adapted to him and we just blew up from there. All right, the first time I met Noah Bolden, uh, I came to a Christ the King practice. Uh, then I was on the staff at Petty, and uh, Coach Brown kept trying to get me to come back to New York and be the offensive coordinator at Christ the King. So uh, I finally stopped by one of the practices, and I go out there, and I, I see Noah and uh, another quarterback by the name of Nathaniel Prophet. So, you know, we're out there, and I'm just watching, but I'm in the background allowing the coaches to do what they do, and Noah gets in to take a rep. So when he took the rep, he made a horrible read. I'm talking about it was God awful. You know what I'm saying? But his arm was strong enough that he threw it in there. He thought he was right as usual. You know, so, you know, I sat back and I asked Coach Brown, can I say something to him just to kind of give him some guidance and everything else? And he was like, yeah, go ahead. So I got to talking to Noah. Noah gave me the illest look like, who are you talking to me? I don't know you and everything else. And, you know, for me, it was like understandable, but you better check my resume. So, <laughs> so uh, you know, Coach Brown, Coach Brown told him who I was and everything else, and we had a little casual conversation, and, uh, you know, then practice ended. You know, um, a lot of people don't know that the reason I'm at Christ the King now is because of Noah. You know, uh, I had a few quarterbacks I had trained prior to that were good, but they were not Noah good. So, for me, it was like, wow, I get a chance to work with this kid from his freshman year. I get three years with him. We can do something to change the world. Noah Bowden, man, let me tell you something. If you want a leader, a guy that can make every throw on the field, a guy from point A to point B, very charismatic, easy going, a guy who's a team first type guy, there's no better choice than Noah Bowden. Thank you everybody for coming. I'd like to thank God for putting me in the position I'm in. Thank my friends and family for being out here to support me. Um, through everything that's going on, I've decided to go to this school and I feel like it's the best decision for me. Without further ado, I'll be attending Grambling State University. Yeah. Yeah. Noah Bowden, a.k.a. Manchild. I think of a young man who is focused on his goals and dreams, but more so a young man who's focused on his craft. I think that Noah will do great wherever he lands in life because of his heart. He has one of the biggest hearts in the world.